Welcome to this iClone template course part 1, where we introduce the iClone template sit here chair, and the AML script editor. Let's load the AML template sit here chair to iClone. Go to the set folder. It is located in the operate dummy folder in the AML templates. A first look in the edit animation layer shows us the structure of this AML template in more detail. We click on expand all. Under test SS we see point zero 0.01. This is the important position helper which means that the actor will move exactly to this point and, if it is instructed in the AML script editor, will execute an animation. This position helper is editable. I select it in the edit motion layer. Then I activate the move tool. Now I can edit the position of the position helper. I can also add new position helpers to this sit here chair template. Well, now let's take a look at what you can do with this sit here chair template. That is the aim of this first part of our course. In this first scene we see the interaction of the original sit here chair with Chuck. First click on Chuck, and then on the template. Then activate an operate action. We activate sit down. Chuck looks unhappy. There are reasons for this. Chuck is in pain as his hands have penetrated deep into his thighs. Fortunately, we can correct this sitting position. That's what I'll show in the second part of this course. Let's take a closer look at the animation in the timeline. In the first part of this animation we see the walk forward process, where Chuck runs exactly to the position helper. Then comes the actual seat animation. Now the first highlight of this course. Here you can see the edited sit here chair template in action. Several low-poly actors go to their chairs and sit on the chair in different ways. Also their running style is different, because they have different persona, which I will explain in more detail in the second part of this course. The AML template only works with an actor if there is also a persona. Now let's enjoy this animation, because it shows the strengths of an AML template. And also Chuck is happy again. It actually shows the original sit here chair animation, but corrected. Let's let the camera do a ride to take a closer look at each seat position. Clearly small corrections to the end seat position I had to do. But this is done in seconds. You only have to make small corrections on the hands at the seat animation in the edit motion layer of the respective actor. 
That's simply because every actor has different body proportions. But if the underlying seat animation is already good, you've corrected it quickly. The most important of course is the seat animation itself. We need a 180 or 90 degree rotation first. Now I import the Heidi Persona. I activate the perform command Heidi stand to sit. As we can see, the seat animation doesn't recognize that our actor has turned 180 degrees. Fortunately there is a new function in iClone. A real highlight to me. Under animation in the motion setting options we find a line to character orientation. It's really important to understand that the actor turned 180 degrees, but not his root. You can see that very well in the transform window. But with the new function iClone recognizes that the actor turned 180 degrees. Now I activate Heidi stand to sit again. Now I can save this seat motion and use it in the UML script editor. The AML script editor. The download link is in the description. This is a great tool, with which we can program countless interactions of an actor with objects. In the previous example I only had to select an actor and then activate a sit here operate command. The rest was done automatically. And honestly, this script editor is easy to understand. At the top left is the command menu. Here we can choose between idle, move, operate and perform command. In our case we need the operate command. Now I simply click on add. Now the important command name appears. This is important because it is displayed in iClone in the operate menu. So it should be meaningful. Since in this case I will activate Heidi's seat animation. I will name it with sit Heidi. In the ML script editor press enter after each action. Below left are the attributes. Lock move should always be activated. Important is the correct name for the position helper. At the sit here chair template the position helper is called .01. So I enter here dot and then point zero one. Then I press enter. Now I add an animation clip. I click on add clip in the upper right corner. I now choose the iMotion Heidi stand to sit. That's it. Now I add a second operate command. I call it medieval. Then lock move. Then I named the position helper dot point zero one. Then add clip. Here I choose the iMotion Medieval Sit. Now I can save this AML script. In iClone I will now import my edited sit here chair template. In the scene manager I select the sit here chair dummy. Now I press the right mouse button. Then I select import drama script. I already have some sit animations. Let's have a look at some. 
In this scene there are four actors with different starting positions and different persona. First I select an actor and then an operate script. Occasionally it is necessary to create a new position helper. Let's have a look at this scene. Jade is definitely sitting too far forward on the chair. I'm loading a box. I call it point zero eight. I scale it down to five. Then I link Jade to the box. Now I bring the box into a position where Jade sits in the middle of the chair. Then box remove object animation and Jade unlink. Then I attach the box to the sit here chair template, more precisely to test SS. Then I bring back the Z rotation of the box to zero. I recommend to set the opacity at the diffuse map to zero. Once again, box remove object animation. Finally I activate merge prop in the sit here chair template under attach. My new position helper is now finished. In the AML script editor I have to change the entry for the position helper accordingly. For the sit and the stand animation. Don't forget to click enter after each action.
Now I load the new ML script into my sit here chair template. I test the new script. Don't forget to save your new AML templates. Thanks for watching.